Hello and welcome to Nature Tastic with Henry. Today I'm talking about my recent trip to Namibia. This film is all about lions and hyenas on our nighttime safari in Atrocia National Park. Let's jump in the truck and go see what we can see. We will only use red light to spot the animals. We won't even have the truck's headlights on. This is so we don't disturb the animals. Keep your eyes peeled. It's risky being a herbivore at night because of the carnivores hunting. These zebra and springbok need to watch out. What was that? It looks like some spotted hyenas on a kill. I wonder what they've caught. Although they're known as scavengers with a reputation for eating leftovers of other predators, don't be fooled, they're really skilled hunters themselves. In fact, they hunt and kill most of their own food. Did you see that jackal sneak in to grab some food? Something's around. I wonder what it is. They keep backing away from the kill. Hyenas really make the most of their meals. They have super strong jaws and teeth and they can chomp through every part of their prey except the horns. Yep, even the bones. It looks like they're coming back to the kill. Oh, yes they are. There they are, looking very nervous. Oop. Oh, they're running away. This hyena is running away with the kill. I think it's a springbok. There's not much of that springbok left. It looks nervous, and this is why. The female lion has come and scared away the hyena clan and now it's trying to sniff out the kill. She's sniffing and searching and looking for that kill. The lion's found it and is going to steal the meal. A female lion needs five kilograms of meat every day. A male needs at least seven kilograms each day. What's left of the spring book will keep this lion going tonight. Don't be misled by the Lion King film. Recent studies have shown that lions are more likely to steal food from hyenas than the other way around. What Disney did get correct, though, was that these don't like each other. These two species are arch enemies locked in battle over territory and food. Whilst lions may have the size advantage, the hyenas make up for this with their intelligence and bigger groups. The hyenas will probably return to finish off the bones. This jackal is straight back over to find any scraps left over. Now it's some hyena and lion facts time. Now it's time for some hyena facts. Spotted hyenas are social mammals and live in structured groups called clans of up to 80 individuals led by one powerful alpha female. Spotted hyenas are also known as laughing hyenas because of their communication with yells, whoops, cackles and some which can be heard almost 5 kilometres away. Of our planet's four different types of hyenas, spotted hyenas are the largest, most common. The others are striped hyena, brown hyena and aardwolf. That's hyenas. Now it's time for some lion facts. Lions usually live in groups of 10 or 15 animals called prides. A pride will have up to three males and a number of females and young lions. An adult male roar can be heard from up to 8 kilometres away. They can be 114 decibels loud. That's the same as a rock concert. <coughs> Known as the king of the jungle, most lions actually live in the savanna or grasslands where there's only one population of wild forest dwelling lions left in the Gur 
Forest National Park, India. And with that, it's goodbye from Nature Tastic with Henry. Bye! Thank you.